Now let's talk about the get child item command line. The get child item command line gets the item in one or more specified location. And if the item is a container, then it gets the item inside the container known as child items. You can use the recurse parameter to get items in all child container. And you can use the depth parameter to limit the number of levels to recurse. The get child item command line does not display empty directories. And when a child item command include depth or recurse parameter, then empty directories are not included in the output. So let's see an example for this. Go to the PowerShell command prompt. And if you want to know the parameters of get child item command line, then we can take help of get help command line. So type get help and mention get child item, hit enter. And here we can see get child item command line supports path parameter, filter parameter, include parameter, and so on. Now let's see an example where we will get the child item for a file system directory. So let's browse to the desktop and let's get the child item for this testing directory. Copy the path, come to the PowerShell command prompt and type the command line get child item. Then we have to mention the path and for that we will take help of path parameter and give the path and hit enter. And here we can see the child items has been written for the testing directory. And the letter in the module property can be interpreted as D stands for directory and A stands for archive. 